Welcome. This video is part of the free course, how to create a platform like Shopify, using WordPress and WooCommerce. This platform will have a beautiful homepage, a pricing page to display your membership plans, and a custom login page. You'll learn how to create a front-end dashboard to let users manage their stores completely from it. To take the course, follow the link in the description of this video. Continuing with the creation of our multi-store platform, we show you how to configure the global settings of the front-end dashboard. We'll do this with the WP Frontend Admin plugin, which allows us to create front-end dashboards, web apps, and show any admin page on the front-end. For this platform, we need to use two sites. The first one is the main site, on which we've created the homepage and the pricing page to show your platform to the world and persuade customers to buy a membership plan. The second site we'll use is the site for the front-end dashboard. We need to create it, so go to Sites on the Multi-Site Network and add a new site. Now let's configure the global dashboard settings. For that, open the WP Frontend Admin Settings on the main site of the network. In General Settings, enable the global settings on multi-site. This means these settings will apply to the entire network. Disable the WP Admin Notices when viewing on the front-end. Users won't see any update or offers from plugins on this network. Hide pages containing the WP Frontend Admin shortcode. This will prevent users from editing the system pages. Select the Global Dashboard site. This is the site we've just created. Remove the disallowed pages from the menu when they are not allowed for the current plan. Save changes and move to the Access Restriction settings. Enter the front-end dashboard URL. For example, dashboard.myapp.com. Later on on the course, we'll set the wrong permissions URL to redirect users to an upgrade page. Finally, select the appearance settings. We need to hide the admin bar on the front-end. But don't worry, because then we can display the logout link anywhere using a simple short code provided by WP front-end admin. Select the loading animation style and color. WP Frontend Admin allows you to improve the appearance of the admin pages on the front end. Select the color you want. If you leave it empty, the admin pages will use the standard colors. The global options have been set and the global dashboard site is configured, so you are ready to continue building your front end dashboard. The next video will be about how to create the login page for your platform using the Elementor Page Builder.